And I'm going to be doing a bridge tour, so... Let's start in the bottom. Oh shoot. The very bottom I meant. So in here, we have our baking, because you know, we like to eat pigs. And then we got some, some bread. We got some good bread that we use French toast. And some more bread, because we're full of carbs. We got some wheat. And some spinach. Okay. And we got some bagels and asparagus in here. I don't know why, because this is the bread and grain area, not the vegetable area, but let's move on. Here in the attic, the reason why I call it the attic is because no one goes in here. You know why? Because it's a vegetable drawer. So let's go. Right here, we have some <clears throat> eggplant that my brothers didn't finish. We have moldy eggplant. Delicious. It tastes so good. We have some ginger because, you know, we like gingers. We have some old green onions because we have green onions. And then, you know, we got the garlic and we got the baby onions. Yeah, and the typical family got the cut off top of a carrot. <sighs> Next drawer. This is level ground level two. Second drawer. So in here we have a new bag of white, uh, wet carrots. And I had some today, but I forgot to wash them. Let's just continue. I have some one dollar snacks, dried cranberries from 99 cents store. I got some salad leaves. Okay, we understand it's open. And I have some other vegetables that I don't know the name of. Third level! On the left side of our fridge, we have some cut up melon, some more salad, oh, I'm sorry, broccoli, Blo broccoli, flow nets. We got some old raspberries, but I love raspberries. We have some, I don't want to ditch that. We got some butter, because every place needs butter. And we got some other things. Now onto this side. We have some Diet Coke, because we're healthy. Some rice. Some orange juice. This is disgusting ranch. I don't like ranch. We got some bananas. And we have some old green peppers that we like to be healthy and sliced peaches are my favorite mm. let's move on to the top level so up here we have some butter and some meat that I'm guessing is being thawed delicious okay we yeah, have some classic hummus that I totally forgot about, but it's okay, my brothers will eat it. And we have a garden of eggs. Let's go to the sides, shall we? So on this side, we have areas to put our things in. And we have some unsweetened silk, organic. We have some silk unsweetened milk. 
We got some coffee made. I don't drink coffee. We got Caesars back there. What a Caesar. We got some Smucker's strawberry stuff that I like to put in. Next side. We have our sauces. We don't have that many. We only got Aunt Jemima in the house. We got some Panda. Yeah, this is the best salad sauce. Next, we have this Filipino banana. Uh, uh. We have this banana sauce, and we got some Del Monte ketchup. Let's move up. So up here's where the butter goes, but we got some chocolate, and we got some. What is this? <gasps> what the? They make these? Oh, I'm gonna try one. I'm gonna set you down right here. So my parents, whenever they have chocolate, they tend to hide it in the butter place. So I, this is my first time seeing a milk chocolate truffle bar. It's by Lindor. Let's see if it focuses. Hopefully it does. And it's milk chocolate. Let's try this. Looks delicious already. I had no idea they made bars. What the? Oh. Mm. It's so creamy. Well, yeah. Get this now. Thanks for the, everyone that requested to do a fridge tour. Like and comment if you want me to do a freezer tour. Because I have a lot of stuff in there, and I thought I'd just show the world. Because a lot of people want to know. But yeah, like, subscribe, and...